happy Halloween. I think that this video is coming out on actual Halloween. I think, I believe, I don't have my calendar in front of me, but this is our Halloween spooky vlog. So, right, what we're gonna do is the pumpkin underwater, which we have done every year, um, but it's a little different this year because I got a baby inside me. Um, so my idea, I don't know if it's going to work, but I mean, the pumpkin underwater will definitely work. We're just not gonna go onto the sand like we do sometimes, but it's okay. So, um, I bought waterproof body paint, face paint off of like Amazon. And I was gonna like paint a pumpkin on my stomach and then I'll have the pumpkin too, like the real pumpkin that we're gonna carve shortly. Um, but I'm gonna go test the body paint right now and make sure it's actually waterproof because I don't wanna spend all this time painting a thing on my stomach and then it just washes off as soon as we get in the water. So we're gonna test that out if it doesn't work. I bought two different kinds. One I know for sure would work, but you're supposed to get rubbing alcohol to like mix in it to make it soft because it's like hard as a rock, but uh, I never got that. so. We're not gonna use that one. Uh, so we're gonna test the other one right now, see if it works. If it doesn't, it's okay, we'll just do without it. Well, the pumpkin underwater is still really cool. And I have this little witch's hat that I didn't wear last year. So also I could wear this in the water, I'm gonna bring it, we'll see. Okay, I can't put it on with one hand, but like, little witch's hat is like on a headband, so it'll hopefully stay on. Um, and then also what we could do is um, which I think we might do anyway. I haven't told Shane yet this though. Um, is like, we did this the first year. Bring Shane's knife into the water with us. And then after we take some regular pictures, um, with the pumpkin, then we cut the bottom out and put it on my head. So maybe we'll do that, but I'm just now realizing, I don't know if we got big enough pumpkin to fit on my head. Cause you have to get like a big one to like actually fit on your head. So I don't know. We'll just see what happens. We're gonna bring our lube cubes out. I think it'll be cool either way, even if it's literally just me holding the pumpkin. And I'll probably wear like a black and orange bikini, which I need to go pick out now also. It's 1.45 now. We're gonna carve the pumpkin at like 2.30ish. And then we're gonna leave around four-ish. Sunset's at like six-ish right now. So that is the plan and we have to carve the pumpkin like last minute like that because in Hawaii, it like we don't have AC in our house and the pumpkin will literally like just on the drive there, it starts to like, like the edges where you carved it, it starts to like suck in and look not so good. So they literally last a couple hours here and that's it. So, okay, let's go test the body paint together. Don't mind my hair and me being really close to the camera. Um, I found this orange bikini top that fits pretty well. So I got this, this, and it came with brushes and it came with translucent setting powder on Amazon. It was like all one kit. I can link it in my Amazon storefront if you guys are interested. So we're going to test it out and see if it's actually waterproof. It looks so pretty and satisfying. <laughs> I think I'll just do it um, like on my hand and then we'll like rub it in the water and see what happens. Wow, it's pretty pigmented. Like I feel like I wasn't getting a lot of my brush. So then I gotta like rinse it to do another color, but we'll just do black. Wow, this, it feels so nice too. Okay, so that's what it looks like. That's our test. We're gonna run it in the water now. Okay, update. I didn't film it because there was no good place for my camera, but they're waterproof, but then they smear. If you touch it at all, they smear. So then I was like, okay, I guess I should try the powder that it came with it because I forgot to do that first. So I did put two test things on there again. The brush was dirty. That's why the orange looks dirty, not because they smeared so far, but and now, I don't know if you can tell, it looks less like wet. So I put the powder on it. And I think that's gonna work. 
because the water won't make any difference. It's just gonna, like it's coming off a little bit, but not nearly as much. So I think that it is gonna work. It just depends if I wanna do it. Also, I didn't get like makeup remover, so it's like, I don't know how to get it off. <laughs> Cause it doesn't come off with soap. Okay, yeah, so it's smeared together a little bit, but not nearly as much as when they were wet. So, and then I've just been like wiping it off really hard with the paper towel because soap just literally smeared it around. Okay, so I can pay my stomach, I guess we'll see if we have time after we carve the pumpkin. I do need to figure out what we're carving right now. So I need to sit down and look at Pinterest. Like I don't know how to get it out of the brush. So like, I guess this brush is only for black now because it's like all black. Um, yeah, so the paint works in case you're wondering. We'll see if we end up using it. We have the outfit. Just so gonna wear our black bikini bottoms with this top. So now we find what we're gonna carve for the pumpkin. Okay, so what we have learned over the years of doing this is that you cut, you're taking it in the water, you're gonna cut the, a hole in the back of the pumpkin. You're not gonna cut the top off because it will float away. We didn't do that ever, but that's what would happen. And we don't cut the bottom off because then we can put like a, a weight in there to weigh it down and we can put um, the lights in there. So Shane is so fast at covering pumpkins from the past. Like he always finishes this so much before me. So I'm making him at least cut the hole in the back and help me scrape it out. What? You weren't gonna draw the design? I didn't get there yet. Oh, oh it's just, it's just water. water. Okay, okay. I thought it was coming up from what I was doing or something. Uh, so I think this is the design we're gonna go with. I think I just want something simple because I think it would be cute if I paint on my belly that I do the same design on my belly that this pumpkin is carved. What do you think? Yeah. So I did one with like one heart eye and it was like winking with the other one last year, but this one is just like two heart eyes and then like the squiggly mouth. What do you think? Yeah, cute. So I think that's what we're gonna do. too bright yeah that's better yeah, but but you might we'll, need it we'll need it underwater we'll yeah. need it on high level but that looks really cool so see that's why we carved the hole in the back because then i can hold the light while we're taking the photo to put it in the right spot and yeah. like because i am going to put some free dive weights in the bottom of him because i'm not going to wear my belt so then i will be able to stay underwater because i'll be holding him and it's so floaty yeah, they're floaty, but not once you have them in the water for a little while. So, like, like they are floaty when you first get out there, but then they s eventually soak up the water and they become so heavy. So we took these photos last year where we were, like, swimming at the surface and we were holding two pumpkins each, like me and my friend. And we were, like, drowning. I <laughs> couldn't, and I was, like, barely could keep my head above water. So that's more of what we're going for this year, I think. Um but then like up the front so that you can see my pumpkin. So it'll be like pumpkin, baby, 
It's so hard to see in this camera angle, but I swear I have a bump. Uh, on my belly and then this one. But yeah, so that's it for the carving portion. Um, I'm gonna put him in the fridge probably and then we're gonna get our stuff ready and we'll see you guys when we get in the water. This is my POV, I can't see. <laughs> That's my stomach. Shane's it's like I get one stroke with the yellow and then the brush turns orange. So I'm trying to just put a couple lines here and there. And then because it'll still have the face on it, so we don't want to do too much of the the curvature and overstroke it, but that looks pretty good right there. Yeah, that okay. definitely looks pumpkinly. Okay. So it's so embarrassing because it's a weekend and there's like so many freaking people down at the water and I have to walk in the water. There's like this beach has like one little small entrance to get in and that's it. We're also just doing this right in the parking lot. So it's kind of uh, embarrassing. Oh, the black now. Uh, yeah. For the heart eyes and stuff. Yeah, yeah. And then also the water looks terrible. It's all it's like weird wind so the texture of the surface is like really bad and very wavy so i was gonna try to do some at the bottom in the shallow spot but it's okay watch out with your hair but it's probably too wavy to go in the bottom to change it you can do a smaller brush if you if it'll be easier yeah, this is good. and then the baby kicks and it's like Wow, that was good. The stroke game is strong. <laughs> and I changed into all black bikini because I think that it'll be a lot of orange, so. Pretty good. We have to color them in, right? I know. Oh. You gotta kinda twist to make it not so lopsided. Wow, why is it lopsided? Oh, just one eye is a little bit too high. Oh, oh there it goes. Oh. That's what we wanted. Are you like, supposed to put a lot? Yeah. Call me for your Halloween body painting needs. <laughs> Here we go, let's see if it uh, stays on. One last video. It's perfect. Nice. Okay guys, so we got out to the spot. It actually looks pretty good considering the weather conditions. Brittany's paint stayed on. It looks really good. The lighting is pretty good. We're going to start shooting right now, I think. Yeah. And then uh, as the sun sets, we'll be out here until just a little bit after sunset. And that's when, that's when it gets spooky, but really, really good.
you see that little fish? He was up on the pumpkin line. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> Gaussian blur 50. What? It's uh, an effect. It also kind of looks like the Joker makeup. What do you want for dinner? I don't know. Why are you asking me that right now? I don't know. I was thinking about it. The lighting's nice, so we might as well get some some clips over here. I didn't here. think about this part really because. Uh, and she wore an Eras to her shirt here, so you only have like 15 of those. You won't want to mess it up. I don't. That's my only big t-shirt that fits over the belly really oh, comfortably. Oh, well, I'm making progress. It'll yeah. be fine. Oh. 
watch watch when you're delivering and then they're like why is there orange and black in your belly button and you're like uh, i couldn't get it out no my belly button will pop out before then and then it'll come out easily they better put that back in i'm not trying to see that what the hell what do you mean it doesn't pop like it you know what i mean that better be as as weird looking as it gets right there no it's i'm gonna get bigger why not do it till january nah, this is a max right here i don't want any bigger i want a small baby <laughs> coming from the guy who was a 10 pound baby <laughs> the lighting is so nice so i'm tripping out Okay, so anyways, the photo shoot went really well. I'm really happy with it. I'm really tired now. Yeah, and everyone had to talk to us like we got here. We'll and... talk to them about this all in the car. All right, I just wanted I to talk while the good, lighting was so nice. So well. Successful. Okay. Successful photo shoot. I'm excited to edit the pictures tomorrow. Cool. My hair is definitely so effing naughty right now. Okay. So I'm just going to take a shower when I get home and condition the work oh. out of it. Why are you taking your shirt off? It was on backwards. Oh no. <laughs> but uh, yeah, the water was literally so bad. Like it was warm moving, at least. Yeah, it was warm, but like moving wise and like the choppiness, but we still got the beams at the surface, which I told Shane it doesn't have to be glassy to get that. And he didn't believe me. Yeah. And there was like some waves coming through, but it kind of helped because the wave would produce this certain angle where it would be like sometimes no beams and then sometimes all the beams. And yeah. so I would just be like holding the button down and then hoping that Brittany's like holding her pose <laughs> and then like, or like hitting the pose just right I'm as sure the there's, wave hits. There's, so, there's definitely like lots of good ones yeah, in so there. Yeah, so that's all we we do like three or four takes of each pose and then like just do so many different poses and angles and tries and yeah, so. It, and this, uh, okay, so first of all, when we're doing a photo shoot like this, it requires a lot of focus and not getting mad at each other and like concentration and yeah. like I know we look kind of cringe everyone there is so crowded today <laughs> everyone was staring at us was fine you can stare at me but like everyone wanted to talk to us too and I'm like can you please yeah. shut the f up kindly like, like some kids I, th I think they didn't even recognize us they just saw that we had a bunch of cameras and they're like are you a youtuber can you tag me can i be in your video she was like my camera's dead yeah which is like it's cute but uh kids always say that and it's like no. And like when we're in the water, of course, like nobody is out today. Of course, there's three people right next to us, and then they just slowly stay there. I'm like, can you not see we're like doing they something? Wanted to can hang you out. go away? Like, yeah. out of all the place in the ocean to be right now, you have to be right here. And all the and then times. I dive down to do something, like, because we're trying. Shane's like, keep shooting. So I'm trying to ignore them, even though I want to swim away and go somewhere else. And then they come, they're like, excuse me, when we come up, like watching us. And then I'm like, oh my God, what are you going to say? I'm going to punch you. <laughs> Um, there's a shark near here. Like, oh, no crap, it's the shark ocean. Shark in the ocean, ooh. Uh, like, like, just a Galapagos, but yeah, like, what do you want us to do, get out? Like, is you do own the ocean now? You're trying to scare us off or something? Like, uh, sorry, I'm being complainy, but like, I, when we're doing these kind of photo shoots. Don't it's, talk to Brittany. <laughs> it's only when we're doing these kind of photo shoots. Yeah. Otherwise, I can, like, that would annoy me a little bit, but I would, like, pretend to be nice and be fine. But yeah. like, this, I like already feel cringy and stupid because I have a pumpkin painted on my stomach and I'm already self-conscious because I'm pregnant and fat now and I don't want anyone to talk to me right when we're in the middle of doing something. It's not like we're just chatting, hanging out and people are like coming up and talking to us. It's like we're in the middle of doing stuff and people have to talk yeah. to us. You know what's cool though that I realized is every other time we've done a themed photo shoot we at least like fight a little bit because it's like she said it's like so difficult very and so challenging and we both want the same thing but like there's always a miscommunication where i'm like <laughs> i'm like turn and then she like turns not what i wanted and then i'm like turn your body and then she like turns her body the wrong way and i'm like to the left and then she's like <laughs> and and like that kind of thing and then i eventually i'm like come on and then she's like, and like what? why are you yelling at yeah, me yeah and 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 then the light changes or whatever because it's like you have to just do everything so fast and so perfect and then so this time it felt like you understood everything that i said and were able to do it and then even like under the water one time i can't remember if the gopro was recording or, or if you'll be able to see this but she was like holding the pumpkin and the light was like right up in it and what happens is it like doesn't show through so you need to pull the light back and i was i was like how do i tell this to her while we're doing it and we have like two seconds down there and so i'm like grab your light 
pull it back. <laughs> and she did it, like, right away. And I was like, yes. The moral of the story, we didn't fight today, yeah. is what Shane was trying to say, I think. But, uh... Oh, and, like, Shane's painting my belly in the parking lot because you can't do... Because it's wet. And this guy comes over and is like, I saw some turtles, and over here I saw a spotty you ray I'm like, I was so badly want to be like, can you fuck off? Because do you see what we're doing right now? Why are you talking to me about turtles? Uh, yeah, I'm like, zo <laughs> like I'm like zoomed in on her belly, like I'm freaking Michelangelo on the Sistine Chapel, <laughs> trying to get uh, like everything, uh, like I'm like making it perfect, like I want this to look so nice. Everyone's then, probably staring at us now too because we have these bright ass lights yeah, on in the truck. And yeah, I like wanted to make this look so good, and he's like, T -t ton just. <laughs> I don't want to repeat what you said, but yeah, it yeah, was like. So it was just. Mm -hmm. Uh, like we could have drove down to a further away beach but then it was like the same probably result because we just needed to get in the water but i just didn't want to talk to him. i wish you could just wear a sign in public when you don't want anyone to talk to you and be like please just fuck off kindly <laughs> but like i don't want to talk to you today this is not the day so anyways it went well though i think i mean obviously we didn't edit the pictures yet but make sure you follow me on instagram if you want to see all the photos and stuff yeah, and I'll definitely be making a video for him today. That little fish that swam on you yeah. was so cute. <laughs> he was swimming um, on the pumpkin first. I was going to tell you, but then I, I we, saw were losing the whole light. Time. we were losing light, and I didn't yeah. want to waste video footage on the, uh, the fish. Yeah, but I, I got just that, that little bit of the little fish with your belly. I thought that was really cute. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so follow our other uh, social media to see. and. The so happy out. Halloween. I hope you guys are having a good Halloween. Yeah. I'm um, not sure we're probably not going to do anything crazy for Halloween, but it we is... We might do a little thing at our house. You never know. It is fun to do these photo shoots, uh, even though we said a while back we were going to stop doing them. But I think by this is the third year we've done a pumpkin. I think we're kind of experts at the pumpkin underwater <laughs> now. So we didn't fight today. Yeah. So make sure you smash subscribe, like this video. Um, and also smash the pumpkin. Okay. <laughs> That's all the stuff we, so we saw. saw. Bye. Bye. It's a band smashing pumpkins.